this is currently the final setup. I was playing around with it a little bit before. So what's really cool about this table is that it actually, you can lift this up and it becomes like two separate tables. But this one is like half as tall as this one. So I can like double surface area if I need to. Moving up here, I have laid out two coffee table books. And I actually purchased these during the pandemic with the intention of them actually being books that I put on my actual coffee table. So when I finished building this, I just took these out because I had them so prepared. So the first one is this GOT7 pictorial book for their last album, which is Breath of Love. And I got the Chinyong version. So if y'all don't know, GOT7 is my favorite K-pop boy band and Chinyong is my favorite Member. And so this is just a book of his face. So my guests can enjoy this beautiful thing. And then I also have the San Chinatown love letter zine that my nonprofit org put together, which is also so beautiful. There's so much good content in here. Very vibrant, like the ideal coffee table book. Next to that, I just moved my Matisse line drawing onto the table. It used to be like behind that chair peeping out and I think it looks pretty cute on this table. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it, but we will see. And then my Christmas tree and this is just my little reading nook. So I am getting ready for the day and I thought that it would be a really good time to show y'all a couple of new pieces that I just received from Urban Revivo. So a big shout out and thank you to Urban Revivo for sponsoring this portion of today's video. For those of y'all who are not aware of the brand, they're actually a pretty big fashion brand over in Asia and I go to China to visit my family quite often pre-pandemic so every time I'm there I always shop at their store in person. Um, they're always at like all of the big malls there and I really love their stuff and I felt like I was really restricted to only purchasing their stuff when I travel, which obviously does not happen anymore. But actually I was really surprised and excited when they reached out to me to partner with me because now they have opened their online store and they ship worldwide. And I'm excited to show y'all these pieces and give y'all a little taste of what the brand is about. So this is the first piece. This is a contrast tweed plaid jacket. And I just love tweed in the winter. It just looks really high end for some reason. So I really gravitate towards tweed pieces. There are little gold threads in here, which I think really make the piece sparkle and stand out. Next, I have this black little oversized jacket and it has like a contrast trim with like gold embellishments which is super cute and there are lots of gold buttons here too and here's a little close-up of the detailing the buttons I got this one in a medium I got the other jacket in a medium too so you can see how the fit is a little different next up we have this light blue knitted dress and literally i feel like a princess in this dress i don't think i own anything in this color and the buttons are literally so cute and i love the square neckline i think personally square necklines look really flattering on me okay next up we have a completely opposite dress this one is a black faux leather a-line dress I love A-line dresses. I think it makes your figure look really good. It kind of cinches at the waist and then goes out. So very, very flattering. And what makes this dress really unique is the straps. These are actually silver chain straps. And I just love how every single piece, there's so much attention to detail that goes into it. And then lastly, I have one more dress. This one is more of like a summer springtime dress actually, but I just saw it and I really liked it. I guess it's summer somewhere, right? Or spring somewhere. This is like a really casual 
button down dress. It's actually like buttons here and then a wrap around here. And yeah, this is like kind of classy and like elegant and also just so chill and simple. I am surprisingly the first one at practice today. <laughs> I'm always late. <laughs> Alrighty, so this week we are doing a cover of Scientist by Twice. This is practice number two. I had the first practice on Tuesday, today is Saturday, and then we are filming tomorrow. No one is here yet. It feels actually quite good to be on time and to be the first one here. Pat on the back. I just did my makeup and my hair, curled it. Today we are filming Scientist by Twice at Washington Square Park. Yet again, I feel like the covers that I've been bringing y'all to are located there, but it's a really nice area. And I'm wearing this dress that I got from Urban Revivo. I ordered this before the cover and it just fits so perfectly because we decided to go with the blue and pink color scheme. And today I am dancing Chaeyoung's part, so she is wearing blue. So it fits really nicely. I paired it with this little cute lettuce cut turtleneck. I'm so tired. I'm hungry. Oh my gosh, french fries smell so good. <gasps> Should we get Palmy de Frites? Palmy de Frites. Let's go get some Palmy de Frites, yeah. Palmy de frites. yeah. You're hungry from sitting there and doing nothing? Um, first, watching you guys. Second, recording for you. Third, um, reading my Kindle. <laughs> that took a lot of brain time. That is you know, true. I had to hold my Kindle like this. <laughs> You're holding it like that? I was like reading like this. Wait, you I, don't have gloves, right? I can't turn on I can't turn the pages like this. I have to like take it out and then turn the page and then put it back in. I said I can mask this middle <laughs> Ma <laughs> mask, mask fish. This? <laughs> I can mask fish people with this mask on. It like makes me look like I have a jawline. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. When I don't. <laughs> right? I swear she's prettier under the mask.
a lot of jewelry as presents this year. So for the Missouri Black Friday sale, I picked up some engraved bracelets for my sisters. Then I got one for myself as well. Sister bracelets. This one's upside down. So these are like, I think 14K gold. And I just wanted to treat them to something nice for the holidays. Very cute.